What's up, guys, and welcome back to Digging Sports, Episode 5. Today, we're going to dig up our picks for the Week 0. Today, I got with me, you've seen him before, my dad, and now I got my brother in here, Brandon, in here with me. We're going to go through these lists of Week zeros, and we're going to pick out our our picks. Um, like I said, if you got anything that you want to say, put it in the comments. Other than that, you know, like, subscribe, share. Um, tell your friends. Tell your friends, absolutely. Other than that, let's get started. All right. Week zero, guys. It's right around the corner. You guys ready? Yeah. for week zero. Chomping at the bit. <laughs> I'm ready for week one. <laughs> one, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Anyway, starting out on week zero, we got a 12 o'clock game. We got Austin Peavy. At Western Kentucky, I'll I'll pick first, and then we'll go to you, and then we'll come to you. Good. All right, Austin PV at Western Kentucky. There's no spread on this game. With my pick, I'm gonna go with Western Kentucky. I think Austin PV may be able to keep it close, maybe first half. I think second half, Western Kentucky's gonna pull away. And and this game is played at where? Uh, Western Kentucky. Give me West Kentucky. Home field advantage. West Kentucky. I don't think a 12 o'clock kick is going to have that much to do on a Western Kentucky game, but I will still take Western Kentucky. West Kentucky. West Kentucky across the board. Across the board here. All right. 12.30 kick. We're looking at Nebraska at Northwestern, televised by Fox. Nebraska is a 13-point favorite. I'm going to say this. I say Northwestern covers. I think they covered the 13 points, but I think Nebraska wins the game. I, I don't I don't see I don't see the cover. I I see Nebraska winning the game, but I don't see the cover. Don't see the cover. I got the complete opposite. I got, you know, games 12-30 kick at Northwestern. I think the Wildcats going to be too much for them. First game of the year. Uh, be jacked up. Be jacked up. I'm, I'm predicting maybe some black uniforms coming out. I don't know yet, you know. Who knows? First week. I, first, okay. first week I got I got the Wildcats on an on upset. All right. Upset on the board already. <laughs> nice. <clears throat> All right. A 3-30 kick. We're looking at at Idaho State at UNLV. I'm gonna go UNLV on this game. I think Idaho State just doesn't have anything for UNLV at this point of the season, especially early. UNLV, give me them. UNLV at home, and like you said, the long travel, different time zone. Yeah, I'll take. Them. Like I said, who is either one of these teams? This is week zero. <laughs> Give me it's a, week zero, baby. Week zero. All know. right. I'm not even saying the game's even <laughs> relevant, but, you know, give me UNLV. Yeah, just yeah because not, not even a spread on this game. UNLV across the board. All right, 4 o'clock kick. We're looking at UConn at Utah State. Utah State is a 27-and-a-half point favorite. I'm going Utah State. I think they roll in this game. Um, you think they cover? Yeah, I'm gonna take Utah State to cover twenty seven and a half. I got Utah State. Against UConn. The Huskies. The Huskies. I think I think they win. I don't think they cover. Then they win, don't cover. Win don't cover. Me personally, I got uh, I got Utah State winning this one. UConn will never see a lead in this whole game. Never. Okay. Bold statement. All right. Also a four o'clock kick. We got Wyoming at Illinois. Illinois is a 10-point favorite. <sighs> I think this is going to be really, really close. I think this is going to come down in the fourth quarter. Can I ask you why? Why do you see this one close? I just I feel like Wyoming can play with Illinois. Illinois has just not been there in recent years. Same thing for Wyoming. I feel like they're just – on the same level right now. But Illinois does pull out those big stops. You know, they, they have big upset games. They, they play with the majority of the teams in the Big Ten. They do. I'm not saying they I'm do. taking them. But 
They do. Um, but like I said, um, I will take Illinois in the game. Um, but I, I do think Wyoming covers a 10 point. I, I, this, these games are so tough to pick. They're they're really hard to pick. But give me the Cowboys. Give me give me Wyoming. No, I won't take Wyoming. All right. I started off, you know, I looked at the game and I said, you know, I was going to take Wyoming. But, you know, the more and more I sit and think about it, the more I said that, you know, Illinois plays with these big schools and, you know, you just never know what can happen in these games. <laughs> yeah. I, me personally, it being an Illinois 4 o'clock kick, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go Illinois to cover. I'm going to cover and, and, gonna, and maybe pull wow. away at 17 or 24. Wow. All right. Cool. All right, moving on. Five o'clock kick. I'm sorry if I pronounce this wrong. Do Quincy? Can we just skip this? Because Florida, Florida State, Florida, is State trash them. Florida State rolling in this one. <laughs> we got the same picks on Don't this. Don't even worry about yeah. calling the name out. It's, it's, <laughs> o- it's over now. <laughs> it's Florida over State now. Covers. Florida State Done. all the way in this one. Yeah. The, the, the crappy. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> Seven o'clock kick. Charlotte at Florida Atlantic. I got I got the Owls in this one. Um, haven't heard much about Charlotte. I think Florida. Uh, I think Florida Atlantic will be the better team in this whoa, game. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, it's my pig, dude. Go ahead. <laughs> He's trashing on the Forty Niners. Uh, the Forty Niners. <laughs> I'll tell you this: the Forty Niners have, have, you know, they've built a pretty good program. Over the years, uh, you know, yeah, they don't get the the great big recruits. They're in the same state as as uh, North Carolina. They got a battle with Clemson. Yes, they're not going to get those big recruits, but they still have a pretty decent little program. So you know, so you take you high on you high on Charlotte in this game. I'm not saying I'm high on them, but you're 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 you're, you're dogging them, and they they. The 49ers will play better in this game than what you think. Uh, I got I got to go with Owls. I got to go with Owls. Okay. Going with Owls? I'm going to take the Owls, but I, I'm, <laughs> all I'm saying is – Look out. It Florida could. Atlantic, watch out because <laughs> – It could get interesting. All right. All right. Moving on, guys. 8-15 kick. We're looking at Florida A&M at North Carolina. North Carolina rolls. Uh, yeah. North Carolina rolls. The covers. I don't know the spread, but... Not even the spread on this one. It's, uh, yeah, it's... I'm pretty sure the spread's 700 or something. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, you know... They're going to cover. In, in all reality, I mean... It's a mismatch. Who is Florida A&M? I mean, I know they're... Green and purple and black and <laughs> you know different colors. I don't I don't care. You wearing lime green jerseys, orange. It don't matter. You get your butt whipped. Uh, the Tar Heels are gonna handle you. I mean, you you you're really doing this for a chick to take back home. Now, let's just be honest. <laughs> All right, nine o'clock kick. We're looking at North Texas at UTEP. The line is even in this game. I think I'm going with UTEP in this game. I, I feel like home field advantage is going to play in their favor in this game. UTEP has really leaned on the run here in the past few years, and I think the more they lean on that run, they're going to wear down North Texas. I think it will be a close game, but I think at the end, North Texas will fall. I got I got it different. I got it different, but I got um I got North Texas because I've been I've seen North North Texas play. You know, at Sanford Stadium in um, Dooley Field, and that they they give Georgia a good game. I mean, I, I got North Texas. North Texas, okay. Like I said, I was I was actually there with you that game. Um, you know, Georgia they they ran away and they trashed them. Um, but at the end of the day, I mean. You go back and you look, North Texas every year will play one of these big SEC programs every single year. I don't care if it's Arkansas, Ole Miss, Georgia. I don't care who it is. They They play. They don't quit. They have, you know, they're not bad. So, give me me North Texas. I'll take them. All right. North Texas, 
And I got you, Tip. All right, moving on to the 10 o'clock kick. In week zero, we're looking at Nevada <coughs> at New Mexico State. Nevada is a nine-point favorite in this game. I think Nevada goes on the road, and I think they get it done in this one. You know, you know who was from New Mexico? Well, not really from New Mexico, but he lived and fought and died in New Mexico. Billy the Kid, baby. Give me New Mexico. You know, Billy the Kid, you know, whatever. I don't care who's shooting who, whatever. You know, at the end of the day, New Mexico, you know, that's a good program. It is going to be in New Mexico, but Nevada is not, not far away. They're going to travel well. I, I, I got the Coyotes. I, I, I got them coming to New Mexico State and, and, and handling business. You know, nine-point favorite. I, I'm, I'm going I'm to take it as far as 16. I'm going to take 16 points with the Nevada, the, the Wolfpacks. So. I agree with that. I agree. And then finally in week zero at a 10-30 kick. Vanderbilt at Hawaii. Ooh. Vanderbilt is a six and a half point favorite. I love the SEC with all my heart. I believe in the SEC, but the SEC will drop it in this game. Hawaii wins this one. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'll go ahead and put you a score out here. I like them by two scores. Give me 31-17, Hawaii. You know. My son, I love him to death, but I live and die by the SEC. And let me tell you something about Vandy. They're sick of losing. They're going to go, and they're going to kick a wife's ass. Give me Vandy. Vandy, okay. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I live and I die by the SEC as well. You know, there's no other conference like it. But at the end of the day, you know, Vanderbilt, Nashville, Tennessee. That's that's a ways. That, that's tomorrow, the next day. I mean, that that's that's a that's a trip. That's okay? a far travel. That's a long travel. Ten thirty kick out in Hawaii. Aloha Stadium will be will be rocking. Um, the Rainbow Warriors. I, I you know I got them covered and I, I got them outright winning. Remember what I said. Vandy's tired of losing. Remember what I said, Aloha Stadium. <laughs> uh, and I'm sorry for this. Vanderbilt will keep losing this season. I will go ahead and say they might as well just go ahead and join whatever conference that is out there. Yeah, <laughs> Vanderbilt is not looking good. Hell, let's just pick up Van. I mean, let's pick up Hawaii and drop them over there. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm sick and tired of watching them go until they make the SEC look terrible. Bad, yeah. yeah, they do. Anything else, y'all guys, want to talk about before we wrap this thing up? For week zero, week zero. Um, like I said, it's not. I mean, granted, college football is coming back, ladies and gentlemen. It's coming back. Uh, I think so, everybody's going to be excited. I'm so ready. I'm you know, so I didn't. You know, I don't care football. who's playing. I'm going to watch it just because I've been waiting, <laughs> yeah. waiting so long. But it's been a long year. I'm waiting to see my dogs. I know Brent's waiting to see his balls, and you know. And whoever just, else is playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's just we're, watching we're, football. Yeah, yeah. Just Love watching it. all kind of football. Love it. I can say we're you know, everybody's excited. Week zero, you know, not the best games, but at the end of the day, it's college football. It's college football. It's time Amen. to get after it. Amen. Uh so hell. Let's 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 get this this season started off right. Absolutely. Anyway, guys, y'all be sure to like, subscribe, share, tell your friends. Don't um, forget hit that like button. Yeah, yeah, dude. Hit that like button. Awesome. But other than that, as always, keep digging. Keep digging.